what's going on everybody? Red Run on Music here bringing you another video. Today we've got the Karen 190Z on GTA Online. I decided to cut out that whole opening process that I normally would do just to save some time because this thing looks like it has a lot of customization. So let's get into it. Uh, obviously I'm going to customize this car first so you can see what it's got going on. And then we'll take it out on the street and I'll let you know if it's worth buying. So it's got a lot of customization. I'm worried I'm not going to even have enough money. Um, as for these arch covers or art covers, whatever you want to call them, I don't know if I like any of them. We're going to have to see what's going on with the rest of the car. I do like that little 190Z that pops up in the bottom. Uh, right in front of the back wheel when I put these on. Uh, let's see what else we've got. Screw all of the performance for now. See, I was I, I tweeted about this thing last night because I was saying hopefully the comet comes out instead because I personally like it more. But now that I see what we could do to this thing, I'm kind of a fan. Yeah, some of these are actually pretty cool, like mods for it. Uh, I don't understand the difference between sport and drift. Okay, no, there's a little bumper in the sport. I kind of think I like. I wonder if that's our secondary. No. I also kind of like this exposed bumper. Makes it look like a resto mod, like classic car. Let's get a little wild. We'll go with drift, see what happens. The rear. I don't like that this is the same rear off the GT500 or whatever that car was. It's literally the same rear end. Um. We're going to go with something simple. Probably just this tow hook. Oh god, we got all this stuff. Why'd they drop this randomly, like, super customizable car? <laughs> We're gonna leave the engine, because nobody's gonna see it. Might do that, like, eventually, but I'm saving money so we could get to other stuff. Yeah, screw all that. Let's see what we got in here. There is so much for this car. What is this? What? I just want to know why they like got extra out of nowhere. I don't like that it leaves the cutout and the bumper for the exhaust, even if you move it. Where the hell are these? Oh my god, what is this car? This thing is wild. I like these. I like how it's flush. That's crazy. That's actually pretty clean. I think we might have to do that. I want something chrome for the front. I don't want it open. I that that's the only chrome we get, though. It just looks ridiculous. I think we're gonna leave the stock one? What does that look like? Can you tell what I'm looking at? It's too dark. Yeah, no, we're leaving it stock. This is stupid. I'm not gonna do that. That just looks awful. There's, like, such a huge gap between the radiator and the grill that it's dumb. The ridged insert's probably the one I'm going to go with, without even looking at these other ones. I'm not a fan of vanity hoods or anything. This is doable. I feel like I've seen 240s with that. Where's that ridge? You got great taste. Uh, we'll look at these last before we paint.
Mirrors, I want... I kind of like none. We're going to have to go with none. I was going to want the hood ones, but they look kind of stupid. And what stupid exhaust can we put on this thing? It's probably, or I mean, spoiler, it's probably going to get crazy. Yeah, what the hell is that? That's probably 30 feet wide. Not really, but it's it's large. I think we're just going to go with something clean. One of these, like, little tails. That one doesn't look bad for 20 grand, though. Ouch. Slam it out. Windows, we're going to leave alone. Wheels, we'll get to after the color. Uh, so trim, we could do this. That's whatever. Probably not going to even mess with that. I kind of want to go with like a Nissan style orange, which is like a mix of this. We didn't even look at deliveries. Probably should have looked at that before I painted. I'm probably going to want some. What, what the hell does that even mean? A bunch of drift deliveries. That is really nice, actually. Um, I don't know what I would do with that. Perhaps like a red paint for the car. That's actually really cool. I don't think I want it though. Still want it like custom looking. I don't want the livery to overpower. Wish they had a white one of these. See what this thing's about. Now, Rockstar's, like, teaser for this thing when they released it earlier was this thing drifting like crazy. Obviously, you shouldn't believe the hype because I highly doubt that's possible. Nothing drifts in this game, as everybody knows. You basically have to, like, force feed it the uh, handbrake to get it sideways. Not crash it. Let's get on the highway. I mean, it does drift a little bit, just because the back is where, like, the back is so short. It's like you have the power wheels doing none of the work for the weight. Let's get on this highway, see what it does, and then I'll let you know. Yeah, so it just feels slow. We're maxing out at, like, 100 it's not the fastest thing. Obviously, if you're buying this, you're in the tuner scene, or you're in like a drifting type of scene. Um, it's one of the most customizable cars that's out. I, I'm convinced this thing could be even a Benny's car. Like, I don't see why it's not. It could be for all I know. I didn't take it over there. But this thing is one of the most customizable cars in the game. Doesn't look that bad. I like it. I was saying it was a little bland on Twitter yesterday, but now it's kind of grown on me just because it has so much you could do to it. Um, is it worth $900,000? Off the customization, I would say yes. Just because even if you don't like it stock or whatever, there's still so much you could do to it. Even that last paint, I already have like another design in my head that I would probably do and I might even do after this video. I don't know yet. Anyways, like I said, if you're in the tuner scene or like the drifting scene or like the JDM scene or you just want a really customizable car, this thing is for you. It's not that bad either. It's just not too fast. I just wanted to mention before this video ends that I ended up changing the look of the car before I or after I finished filming. And I think this thing looks pretty amazing like this. I just went all out, got a little crazy. I put the uh, wide body type kit on it. I have this livery I said I liked. I did yellow paint instead of red. But if you have a friend that also likes this paint, they could also do red. It would look just as good, if not maybe better. I put the big wing. We still have our tow hook. Everything else is the same. I think it came out pretty nice. Anyways, guys, that's it for this one. 
Thanks for watching. See y'all next time. Peace.